Hey, Daddy, scoot over. What, why? To make room for Mr. Hippo. What, no, Mr. Hippo. Yes, Mr. Hippo. Jeffy, Mr. Hippo's huge. He's taking up the whole couch. But me and Mr. Hippo want to watch TV. But, Jeffy, I was watching TV. But me and Mr. Hippo want to watch Animal Planet. No, Jeffy, I was watching TV. <coughs> what, Jeffy, stop. <coughs> stop. <coughs> stop. <coughs> stop it. Daddy, if you don't turn on Animal Planet, then me and Mr. Hippo are going to keep going. <coughs> oh, okay, fine. I'll turn on Animal Planet. <sighs> Breaking news, okay? World-renowned scientist, Dr. Frederick Finkelsheets, has an exclusive interview with an alien inside Area 51. Let's go to that now. Hello! I am Dr. Frederick Finkelsheets, and today I am coming to you live from Area 51, where I have an exclusive interview with a real alien! Now, this alien crash-landed 72 years ago in Roswell, New Mexico in 1947. Now, tell us, alien, where are you from? Oh, yes, I see. He is from the west side. Yes, yes, quite. Now, alien, tell us, what happens at night that caused you to crash your spaceship? I see, yes, yes, you were driving your spaceship. Yes, and you, you were spanking someone. Yes, and then it, it was a bumpy ride. No, not a, not a bumpy. Uh, 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 your, your seat was very bouncy. No, hmm, okay. You, you were doing pull-ups. Yes, not pull-ups. You, you, were, you, were clap, you were clapping something. Clap, clapping? Yes, you were clapping something. What were you clapping? You were clapping a alien cheeks. Yes, you, you were clapping alien cheeks. You heard it here first, folks. This alien crashed his spaceship in Roswell because he was clapping alien cheeks. Now, some of you may be worried that this dangerous alien might escape. But do not worry, he can't escape because he is handcuffed. Show them. The alien got out of the handcuff. It appears the feed has cut off. Wait. I'm getting word now that the alien has escaped Area 51 and the police are searching for him now. They're telling us that he's extremely dangerous and we should all remain indoors. If you see something, don't hesitate to call 911 immediately. Oh no, an alien escaped. Jeffy, that alien could try to clap our cheeks. Should we hide Mr. Hippo? Cause Mr. Hippo got that wagon. Oh man, Jeffy, Mr. Hippo is dummy thick. Should probably turn around before I act up. All right, daddy. I'm thinking about it now, Area 51 is pretty far away from Florida, so we don't have to really worry about the alien. Daddy, me and Mr. Hippo are hungry. Can you order us a pizza? Jeffy, hippos don't eat pizza. Hippos need to eat something they find in the wild, like green beans. Daddy, where is a hippo going to find a can of green beans in the wild? It's not going to be in a can, Jeffy. It would just be regular green beans. Pizza! Fine, Jeffy, I'll order pizza. Just, just continue watching the animal planet. All right, Daddy. The hippo is the second largest animal on Earth. The first largest is your mother. All right, Jeffy, I just ordered the pizza. What if I want wings? You're not getting wings. I already ordered and I only got pizza. Wings. You're not getting wings, Jeffy. Wings. What's that? That can't be the pizza. That was way too fast. Well, Dad, can I enter the door? <sighs> Fine, Jeffy. Here's five dollars. Oh, you're gonna pay me to go get my pizza? Wait, no, no, Jeffy, that's for the pizza man. I am the pizza man, Daddy. I eat the pizza, and so they call me the pizza man. No, no, no Jeffy, Jeffy, no. Whoever's at the door, you give them that five dollars, okay? <sighs> Fine, Daddy. <sighs> Hello? Ah, an alien! Oh, 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 you want me to be quiet? Oh, well, here's five bucks. My daddy told me to give it to you. Why don't you go get a hotel with it? Oh, do you want to stay here? Oh, well, if you'll be really quiet, I think I have a place for you to hide. Come on. Okay, just hide in this closet and don't make any noise, okay? Hey, Daddy. Where Hippo? What? Where Hippo? Hippo there. Where pizza? Who? Where's the pizza? What pizza? The pizza that was at the door, Jeffy. There wasn't a pizza at the door. Then who was at the door? SpongeBob. No, Patrick. Wait, Squidward, final answer. Squidward was not at the door, Jeffy. Who was at the door? Squidward. What? Oh, great. One of the light bulbs went out. Let me just go get the ladder. Wait, the ladder? Okay. <sighs> okay, let me get this ladder. <sighs> oh, man, who's at the door? <sighs> Man, Mr. Squidward, that was close. We gotta find somewhere else for you to hide. Follow me. Uh, hello? Hey there, I got a pizza for you. Whoa, whoa, I don't know what's in this thing. Uh, I'm just kidding, it's a pizza. I just like to keep things fun. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't have a tip for you. My son took your tip money. Oh, okay. What? What? There you go. What? Yeah, thanks for the tip. What? 
<laughs> Enjoy your pizza. Well, why would you do that? Yeah, uh, uh. <sighs> I wish I could do that, but I need this job. So no tip, huh? No. All right, here's your pizza. Sorry. Yeah. All right, Mr. Squidward, I got another place for you to hide underneath this couch cushion. Oh, you can fit? Come on! Jack B, the pizza's here! Oh, oh no! My daddy's coming! We gotta find another place for you to hide! You turned into me? Jack B! Oh, we gotta find my daddy's coming! Jack B, there's pizza downstairs! Wait, Jeffy! Why do you look like that? You don't look so good, Jeffy! Are you feeling sick? Jeffy, you answer me when I'm talking to you. Jeffy, speak. Wait, Jeffy, don't raise your voice at me. Wait, Jeffy, stop. Wait, Jeffy. <laughs> oh, Jeffy, like, come on, it's time to go eat. <gasps> my dad thinks that's me? Oh, well, well, now I don't have to go to school or do my chores or anything. I'm going to go sit in the closet and play Minecraft. All right, Jeffy, here's the pizza you wanted. Bleh, 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 bleh. Yeah, pizza. <laughs> All right, Jeffy, now eat up. <laughs> eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Jeffy, you just threw up all over your pizza. Are you sick? <laughs> Jeffy, I know what you're doing. You're trying to fake being sick so you don't have to go to school tomorrow. You're still going to school tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jeffy, go to bed. <laughs> I cannot believe you threw up all over his pizza. <sighs> Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Jeffy, wake up. It's time to go to school. <laughs> Jeffy, it's time to go to school. <laughs> Jeffy, stop it. You're not faking sick so you don't have to go to school. You're going to school, okay? <laughs> Go to school, Jeffy. <laughs> Go to school. <sighs> All right, class. Today, we're going to be learning about aliens. There are two types of aliens. Riddle green guys who fly around in spaceships and, hmm, you know, like, run, 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 run. Arriba! You know, Canadians. Any questions, class? Hey, freak. Blap. You look like an alien because of how ugly you are. Blap. What are you looking at, you bug-eyed freak? <laughs> Jeffy, why you throw up on other student? Crass, if you sick, you gotta go to the bathroom. Jeffy, go to the nurse's office right now. School? Why is Jeffy's school calling me? Hope everything's okay. Hello? Hello, this is school nurse. My name is Chiquita, like the banana. Okay, uh, is Jeffy all right? No, your baby's sick. He's throwing up green stuff and his thumb fell off. What, his thumb fell off? Is he even alive? Oh, uh, hold on baby, let me check his hot beeps. Mm, 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 mm. No, nah, baby, he sleep. Sleep? What do you mean he sleep? Well, he ain't got no heart beeps, but he's still breathing, though. I think you should come pick him up and take him home. Okay, I'll be there soon. <laughs> I see you soon. That's your daddy. He coming and pick you up. <sighs> Jeffy, I can't believe your thumb came off at school today. You're not in any pain? I guess you really are sick. Who's that? Oh, you're staring here, Jeffy. Yeah. Uh, hello? Oh, hey there. Oh, the cops. Oh, the cops. Okay, yeah, it's such a harsh term. Okay, how about officer? Huh, how about that? What do you want, officer? That's better. All right, now you heard about the alien that broke out of Area 51? Oh, yeah, I saw it on the news. Yeah, well, this tracker here on my phone says he's at your house. What? He's not here. Well, I believe the tracker more than I believe you, because you don't tip when I deliver you pizzas. Well, I haven't seen an alien in my house. Well, I have probable cause, so that means I get to come in and mess up your house looking for him. Well, please don't mess it up. Can you do it, like, really neat? I will promise no such thing. See, look, there's no aliens in here. Just my son and my son's thumb that fell off. What, your son's thumb fell off? Yeah. And that didn't seem weird to you? No, people's thumbs fall off all the time. But no, no, they really don't. They don't? No! Well, well, he's not in any pain. Well, that's even weirder. If your thumb falls off, it should probably hurt a lot. Well, maybe Jeffy doesn't feel a lot of pain. Okay, look, sometimes aliens can morph into people to disguise themselves. And the tracker on my phone says the alien is definitely somewhere inside your house. So I'm thinking the alien just morphed into your son to hide himself. Well, look, I know that. That's my son. I know Jeffy, and that's 100% Jeffy. What are you talking about? It doesn't even look like him. He's all pale, and his eyes are all bugged out, and he's got a big nose. Jeffy always looks like that. What? No, he doesn't. O okay, look, I have a test that can definitely prove if he's an alien or not. Okay, give him the test, then. It's the alien test. Everyone who comes into the United States has to pass this test. All right. All right, first question. Who is the current president of the United States? 
Boop. Poop. Well, he's not completely wrong. Okay, next question. What year was the Declaration of Independence signed? How is he supposed to know that? Are you kidding me? Everybody knows that. Well, I don't even know the answer. Well, take a guess. Uh, 1942? 1942? No! I should be giving you this test. That's completely wrong. Well, when was it signed? 1776. What, that long ago? Yeah, that long ago. Okay, give him another question. Okay, last question. Jeffy, are you an alien? Yep. Well, he, he didn't say yup. He, he, he didn't know. He meant nope. He, he doesn't know the questions you're asking. It's stupid. Jeffy, we don't have time for this. Let's get out of here. Ah! Did your son just come apart at the waist? Yeah. What is he, Darth Maul? I feel like I'm at a Chris Angel show. Well, Jeffy, what, that, that didn't hurt. Yeah, he did, dude. Well, no, he seems fine. Uh, I think he might be an alien. Yeah, you think? Oh, okay, okay. How, how do we know if he's an alien or not? Okay, well, everybody knows that aliens hate water. So, all you gotta do is just squirt him a few times with a spray bottle and he'll lose his disguise. Oh, do it. All right. Yeah, yeah. Aha! I knew he was the alien. I would have never noticed. Yeah, because you're blind. You would have clapped your cheeks and you never would have seen it coming. All right, alien, we're going back to Area 51. Now, uh, here, you, you cuff yourself. I don't really feel like doing it. All right, I'm taking him back to Area 51. Are you sure you have to take him back? Uh, yeah, what are you talking about? He's a dangerous alien. He melted a kid at school today with his acid puke. Yeah, I guess he is pretty dangerous. Yeah, all right, come on, alien, we're going back. Yeah, yeah, all that. <sighs> Today's been a weird day. Hey, Donnie, we're Hippo. No, we're Jeffy. Jeffy here, we're Hippo. N no, where Jeffy been? In your closet playing Minecraft, we're Hippo. I, I don't know where Hippo. Dare Hippo.